Hi, this is Rebecca Delosier, and this is a tutorial on getting your lessons imported into your Google Drive lesson plan folder that was shared with you by your assistant principal. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to log into Google Drive. Um, if you don't have that bookmarked, you'll go to the LISD homepage and you'll go to Staff, and then you'll go to Google, um, and it will bring you to your drive. Uh, you will probably have to log in the first couple times you do this until you tell it to save. Um, my drive looks like this. It's all organized. What we're going to be looking at is the shared with me. So you should have in your shared with me, you should have some files that look like this. And I'm going to make this a little bigger so you can see. Um, mine actually say Deloja Rebecca dash science dash lesson plans. Yours are going to be your department and your name. And then there's going to be one that says your department and edit and then your department and view. So the first thing we want to do is we want to go back to where it says my drive and I'm going to click on my drive and I'm going to create a new folder. So I click the create button and then I click folder and I'm going to call my folder lesson plans and I'm going to call it um, 1314 but you can call it whatever you want and I'm just going to click create and so I have my new folder um, lesson plans 1314 and then I'm going to go back to that shared with me and I'm going to click on those same three files so the lesson plans the Deloja Rebecca science lesson plans the science edit and the science view and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to where it says more here um, in the gray button and I'm going to click the down arrow next to that and I'm going to click move to and it's going to open up a pop-up and on that pop-up it's just the things on your drive so I'm going to move that to my drive lesson plans 1314 the folder that we just created and I'm going to click move then if I go into that folder right there you'll see that those are the folders and they say shared because I don't own those folders your assistant principal owns those folders so now what you would do is anytime you want to go ahead and turn in your lessons you just drag it into this folder and I'm going to show you how to do that but before I show you how to do that I'm going to show you where the templates the standard heat templates are again we've been told that we don't have to use those templates as long as we include the HEAT information but I am going to show you where the templates are stored so again I'm going to go back to shared with me there's a folder called LHS shared files LHS shared files and I'm going to click on that folder and there's one that's in there that says heat lesson plan templates and there are three different options here. There's one that is just a blue square. That is a Google document. There's one that's a Word document. You'll actually have to download that. And then there's one that's just a PDF. And that's really just so you can see what it looks like. Because um, you really can't edit the PDF. I just put it up there because I had a PDF of it. So I'm going to use um, this Google document because I want to be able to drag my Google Docs there. And I'm also going to use this Word document. So let's do the Word document first. If I do this, you're going to open it and it's going to just show it to you. It doesn't let you edit it. So what you'll have to do is you'll have to download it and it's going to ask you to sign in to download. So it, basically you're just continuing. Then what you're going to do is you're going to go down to your downloads and I've got mine open and it's going to open up in a second in Microsoft Word it's going to open up the folder and it's a little cockeyed there but you can see that it's there so now what I want to do is I'm going to actually open up I'm going to open up Finder so you can see what I'm doing here it's in my downloads so let's say I edited that and I saved it onto my desktop so let me put that on my desktop just for pretending. So here's my heat lesson plans. It's on my desktop. I want to go ahead and drag that into my folder. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take it from wherever I have it saved and I'm literally just going to go into my folder, my lesson plans folder. Let me, let me, let me go back and do that again so you can see what I did. I was here in LHS shared heat lesson plans, right? So now I'm going to go click on my drive, lesson plans 1314, Deloja Rebecca science lesson plans. And I have an empty folder because I, I know that my heat lesson plans are due tomorrow, but I haven't dragged them there yet. So I'm going to take this heat lesson plan and I'm just going to drag it there. And it says, would I like to upload and share? And I'm going to click yes. And that's going to automatically go ahead and share my lesson plans with my assistant principal. 
which is the goal here. So it says it's converted and it's shared, which means that it went ahead and it made it into a Google document for me. That's a setting that I have turned on um, and Ms. Rosales or I can show you where to turn that on or off. But let's say that instead of doing it as a Word document, you wanted to do it in Google Drive directly. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go back to Shared with Me and we're going to click here on LHS Shared Files, Heat Lesson Plans, and I have this Heat Lesson Plan Template 2013. You need to make a copy of this on your own. So this is how you do that. You click it, you click on More, make a copy. And when you make a copy, it will show up in your drive. So now I'm going to click on the copy of Heat Lesson Plan Template, and I'm going to put that, move, to Lesson Plans 1314, Delosier Science Lesson Plans, move. And now, if I go back to my Lesson Plans folder, Lesson Plans 1314, my folder, there it is. I have my copy of my heat lesson plan template. So what I would do is anything that's in here is automatically shared. So I would fill this out. Monday's the first day of school. It's 826. Um, I'm going to do my classroom norms using a Padlet. So you would type whatever you want. You go ahead and you rate it by heat. And as soon as you close out of it, it's automatically saved because Google Drive saves everything. It says all changes saved and it's automatically shared. So if you have any questions with that, um, I'm in D room D124. Feel free to come by today or sometime this week, or you can just call me at extension 3185.